Happy Bunny Day. I have my friend with me who's watching. He wanted to come to kindergarten today, I guess. So he won't leave. So he's just going to be part of it. All right. So we're going to start off with a white sheet of paper. And you just want to have it vertical. Remember, we call this vertical or sometimes we say tall like a soldier. So we're going to have it up and down. If you do it the other way, you're going to run out of room. Okay, your bunny's not going to be able to be as big. All right, so we're going to start right here. We're going to come down about a hand, and I'm going to put my circle here because bunnies have big ears, okay? And we want this bunny to have big ears. So I'm going to put my circle here, okay? So there's my circle. Now I'm going to go, I'm going to put my marker here. I'm going to go whoop. Remember, you can make your noises if you want to, too, if it helps you. And then I'm going to go whoop, like that. He's got one big ear, okay? This one's going to be a little bit different. It's going to be kind of like a hook, okay? So I'm going to put my marker here, and I'm going to go whoop, and stop, okay? All right. Now, where I stopped right here, I'm going to come with my marker right there, and I'm gonna come down kind of diagonally, okay? Everybody got that? All right, it's gonna be kind of like his ear is flopped over. Mine's not gonna be perfect. It looks different every time I do it, and that's okay. Yours, may be, yours will look different too, okay? So, now, next thing. We're gonna come right here under his chin, okay? We're not gonna go all the way down. I'm gonna go, like that, okay? And then I'm gonna go whoop on the other side. Got that? All right, now we're gonna put an M, a big M, kind of like a McDonald's M, it's just not gonna be as tall. So I'm gonna start over here, I'm gonna go up, I'm gonna connect right here, make an M, and go all the way down to the bottom, back up, Connect right there and go down, okay? And these are his feet. So we're gonna give him his toes by putting two dashes there and a dash on the other side. All right, now we're ready to add his arms or his legs, I should say, because bunnies don't have arms, okay? So we're gonna give him his front legs and we're gonna go like that. And then we're going to go whoop, like that. Okay? Now he's got his arms. He needs his eyes now. Okay? So we're going to go right here. I'm just going to do a small circle and a small circle here. Simple eyes. Okay? Now his nose is going to be a little different. It's kind of a sweet little nose where we're going to do a heart like this. So do a heart right under his eyes. Then you're gonna go and put a line like this. And then we're gonna go up here and up on the other side and give him a simple smile. Remember, that's what we call a simple smile. We're not giving him lips, he's just gonna have a simple smile. Now bunnies have big whisper, whiskers. <laughs> So we're going to give him whiskers, okay? I'm going to put three on each side. One, two, and three. One, two, three. So now he's got three whiskers. Now I need to go in and add some detail to his ears, okay? Because the inside of the ears are kind of a pinkish color. If you look at your dog's ears, they're kind of like that too. Okay? So we're going to go, we're going to do kind of the same thing we did before where we go whoop. And then we're going to go whoop and connect it right there. Okay? If it helps you, remember you can always make the sounds. Okay? On this one, I'm going to come down like that. And then go to here and stop, okay? That's the inside of his ears. So, our bunny is complete now. But the fun part is how you get to color this bunny. 
I'm going to show you a picture of a completed bunny that I did. If you have watercolors at home, you can do this. If you don't, it's okay. You can do it a different way, okay? If you have watercolors at home, or yes, if you have watercolors at home, you would color this inside your bunny. You're gonna color it all white. The way you change the color of it is gonna be with your paint. So you would color the whole bunny white and then go back and add your details with your color. So up here, you would paint this area pink and it'll make it pink where there's no coloring, okay? Or you can just come in, color this pink, your bunny's white, his nose is pink. They have a sweet little pink nose. Oh, guess what we forgot? Bunnies have cotton tails. We forgot to give him a tail, so watch. We're gonna put it right here and go, whoop, whoop, whoop. Give him a fuzzy little tail, okay? And then there's your bunny. I'm gonna put this up one more time and let you see the coloring. Now, I watercolored across and we did our leprechauns like this too. So you guys know how to do this, if you choose to and if you have watercolors at home. I don't have watercolors or I would show you how to do it. All right, so this is just a fun little project to do and you can do it over and over and practice your bunny. All right, I hope you guys have a fun bunny day. I know your teachers have some fun things planned for you to do online and I will see you next time. Love you guys and miss you. Bye.